This tutorial will tell you how to use quick mask mode in Adobe Photoshop and it's a sequel to our previous tutorial on using layers and masks so you may want to check back if you have questions on those. Now quick mask mode is a little button over here in your tools panel on the left side and if you hover over it it says edit in quick mask mode and what that is used for is to select areas of your image that you want to show or hide and it's great because you don't have to worry about selecting an image perfectly as long as you have something in your layer selected you can always toggle in and out of quick mask mode so you can make changes to your selection so to give you an example if I wanted to select this round hot plate what would I do magic wand doesn't select all the areas um, if I use a circular marquee it's just not quite perfect so how about the lasso tool that would take forever and if I made a mistake then I'd have to start all over again quick mask mode makes it easier start off with a round marquee just to give us the overall shape make that a little bigger there there we go. And then I'm going to click on my quick mask mode button. And you can see it puts a layer of pink colored acetate over your layer. So whatever is colored in pink is what we're going to cut away or discard. Whatever is not covered by pink is what we're going to keep. Now how do I edit this pink cutout shape? Well, get a brush tool. And you can see the brush tool here is black in the color selector but it's really just going to be adding in some of that pink layer of acetate that's what I'm going to get rid of and as I said you don't have to be perfect because you can always toggle in and out of quick mask mode okay so I'll just do that very briefly now if I switch my color picker to white I can take away from that pink acetate and make additional corrections to my selection. All right, let's come out of quick mask mode right now. And you can see I have marching ants around my hot plate. So that is the area I'm going to keep. And I'm going to create a mask now. Add layer mask in your layers palette. And as you see, it is showing the leather background and it just kept the hot plate. Now, now that I'm out of quick mask mode and I have nothing selected, how do I make corrections to the mask itself? Well, you make sure you select the layer that you're working on and then select the mask. And what you're going to do is use your paintbrush again and whatever I color in with black selected in the color picker, it's going to show what's underneath. Whatever I color in white with the color picker, it's going to hide whatever is underneath. So that's just a very quick down and dirty tip on using quick masks and I hope that you find that helpful when you're using Photoshop.